Hello everyone and welcome to RRA here in 2021 for the CFNR Valencian slash Spanish Grand Prix. It's round number nine. It's race day here. And one light, two Ooh. lights, three lights, four lights, and five red lights are coming on now. Let us commence for, for the Valencian Grand Prix. It's here we go. And Love My Jordy doesn't get the best of starts with Soup. Gets a fantastic start, putting him into the lead for the race. Here comes one of the Apollo Motorsports also getting involved, as well as the Boot oh. GP. But it seems like... Um, <laughs> that is very, very close. In the top four but it seems like Randomize. Randomize is leading the Grand Prix. And in the Apollo Motorsports, here we go, Gate fighting off. Love my Geordie now. Here we go, down down the straight now. It's Wasoop, Mr. Mook Show, Love my Geordie. Then it's randomized. These are the top Neil four at the moment. Me. Very, very close at the moment. Following behind is Mama Score Me and Luchabot. And there they go, going onto the bridge now. And randomized is leading this Grand Prix with a decent gap right now. But Mr. Macho and Love my Geordie are fighting it out for that P2 position. And there we go. And Wasoop's also getting involved. Maybe Love my Geordie's got a horrific start. Coming out of that corner. Looking further back though, it seems like uh, a lot of Lens and Boy Gamer <laughs> doing pretty well, gaining positions. But Randomized leading this Grand Prix so far, going into the hairpin now. But it seems actually. Oh, oh this is so like close. Love my Jody seems to have got back whatever he lost at the start. As Ooh, I say. Randomized oh, Randomized goes to the Randomizer bumps. taps us, bumps. Are we talking about Love my Jody? back into the lead just literally starting the second lap oh sorry the third lap of this race it's wheel to wheel almost with Woosop and randomizer going into turn two i think that is um had a good weekend uh, in portugal oh and we soup spun Woosop spun what that's a that's a two three for the um apollo motorsports now so that's oh, put him down to p4 that is such a sad moment if you're that a brawn fan Probably the most competitive Braun driver. But I'm what, starting to wonder if we'll start to see uh, the Love My Geordie and Randomize, the, probably the two most practiced drivers around the track, start to pull away because they have had that much practice right now. They are so close, by the way. Are they? Um, they are wheel to wheel actually down the street. Flipping heck. And it's actually Randomize that's taking the lead. He Goodness has. me. But Geordie's got that inside. Still Freeze. wheels to wheel, or wheel inside of wheel yeah, in Roblox terms. He is. Ooh. Ooh, Ooh and Randomize is crashed. Did he... Oh, he and did. that's allowed. There we go. That's put him down to P6. And that's going to allow Love My Jordy to have a ton of oh. clean air now. Oh. He's got a free second gap to judge mine. Who's that? Christian also spun coming out of the bridge. Oh, that seems He's to be a massive area. Now. Yeah, as and like I was just thinking about actually, the bumps on the track, if you look at every corner, the exit has bumps so close to the track and it really is all, makes you really notice how much these drivers need to keep it within the lines because terrible mistakes like that will happen and you don't want that, especially if you're fighting for the lead like we've seen Woosop and Randomizer do, even Chris Hyun, who is very competitive and was in P4, making mistakes like those can see your race disappear in an instant and you don't want to be doing that too much. So Dakar is actually currently fighting. Don't be confused. Dakar is a boot GP driver. He is fighting his teammate right now. He's just a, a car got deleted. So he has to use an Audi car. So uh, there we go. Dakar now making moves on Mr. Macho. Oh, Mr. Macho probably get team orders. And love my Geordie's just coming to the pits. Oh, he's boxing. So and actually, Dakar. Mate, and Dakar. There we go. So love my Geordie. It, it turns out it probably will be a pit stop this race then. Wow, because Dakar didn't box in Portimao. <laughs> I guess Dakar is getting uh, anxiety uh, flashbacks after Portimao. Because he didn't box and ended up and in, paying the price oh, for that it. That was a very quick stop. That was a, a much quicker stop than Geordie had. So they're going to mm. be even closer. And there we go. All, all those top 
David Boy's top cars are going into the pits now. Mama oh, Squad, yeah. me, Randomizer. They're all going in. It's a double stack for the Apollos. They are out in quick succession. We've also got Woosop in and Zen in in the Lamborghini and Mr. Muxjo. So a lot of those top six, in fact, all of the top, six, top seven have now boxed. Um, as you see, more people moving up. Chris Hun hasn't boxed. Uh, I don't think Luchabot has boxed yet in the sunset, who's down in P10. It's not going great for him this weekend if he's not boxed and he's still down in P10. Usually, you know, when they box, you gain a position or five, but he's not doing that so far. So this might not be a weekend to remember for him. Keeper Gast has been disqualified from the session. He's now driving oh, backwards, dear. which is a bit of a, you know, a bit of an inconvenience if you're driving. So I'm just going to uh, delete just need him. need to get him to pull over on the track. Um, there we go. There we go. He's out now. Oh, they're oh, going so now. Like oh, they're going across the line. Advantage. 34 milliseconds separate these two. It is so close going through turn one. Now Adake looks to be getting the upper hand. It looks like Dakar's got the better exit. But going now into turn two, into turn three. It oh. looks like Dakar's got a little bit of a rear end the moment. The wall. He touched the wall oh, wow. a little bit on the inside. And again. Oh, Dakar's tyres must be going or something. I don't know. You might want to switch back. It's yeah, so yeah, close. Go. Jordy ran over a bump a little bit. And he lost a bit of time in quite a fast section. of Dakar is now ahead. Oh dear, oh dear. Dakar has now got the he lead of a Grand Prix. <laughs> Jordy, like I was saying, how he was so nervous, how he keeps getting so close to these bumps. He just touched a bump. I'll tell you what, this battle between the Apollo drivers is absolutely fantastic. This is a great battle between these two drivers. And it's not like they got any team orders. I bet you Apollo Struck is gleaming from side to side on his smile. And he's, it's beautiful, isn't it? This uh, battle between those two. But I'm going to ask you to keep an eye yeah. on the top two. I'm just I'm wondering gonna... if there's a... a oh, Mum and Scormy, Mum and Scormy hits the wall. That is the ba battle over. But it looks like Love My Johnny's getting closer to Dakar, actually. A little bit. I tell you what, though. Corners behind. Dakar's come through the final corner now, and he's going to win. The Valencian Grand Prix for the Spucci P. I thought, he, I thought he didn't cross the line. <laughs> <laughs> and there we go. That is Dakar winning the championship as well. So Dakar is Drivers World Champion. And Love My Jordy gets P2. As uh, now, it's going to be Randomizer. That's going to be Randomizer's just crossed the line now. And he's got P3, his first ever Good podium job. for Apollo Motorsports. Great job by Apollo today. Thank you guys for watching what was probably the best RA stream, in my opinion, actually. We were, we were joined by Aya King Dawson, Astros, and Purple Sheep. Thank you all for watching, and we'll see you soon at Germany.